You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. I'm back. Rodriguez for Black and White Sports. Well, we continue to see some fallout around this FTX situation that Tom Brady and Giselle Bündchen was all involved with involving Democratic mega donor Sam Bankman Freed. And now a New England Patriot fan, somebody that is a lifelong Tom Brady fan, is now suing Tom Brady because he has lost his life savings getting caught up in what has been described as an extremely elaborate Ponzi scheme, essentially, that Tom Brady was promoting in some kind of way, according to some of the things that have has come out. And now we got a Patriots fan that is mad and has had true repercussions in his life over this. By the way, um, a lot of the people surrounding this is being sued by somebody. There's multiple lawsuits in this, and of course, Freed has been arrested now. This is Breitbart. Fan sues Tom Brady after losing nearly his entire life savings in FTX deal. A man who describes himself as a lifelong New England Patriots fan is suing Tom Brady after he invested his entire life savings in the FTX crypto scheme. Michael Liveros, Liver, Liverostos, 56, says in his filing that he was convinced to invest in FTX after seeing the commercials in which Tom Brady was pushing the company headed by a Democratic mega donor, Sam Beekman, Bankman Freed. As a New England Patriots fan my entire life, you can imagine the influence that Tom Brady would have, the man told the media, according to the New York Post. Bankman Freed has since been arrested and charged with financial crimes in the Bahamas where his company was registered. You should have seen the cringy Maxine Waters video I saw with her talking to him the other day. My God, you can tell the Democrats love this guy. Brady and his soon-to-be former wife, model Giselle Bündchen, were significant actors in selling the company to potential investors. Both also lost millions in the deal. Liverostos has filed suit after hiring attorney Adam Moskowitz, who filed suit against Brady and another FTX frontman Shark Tank co-host Kevin O'Leary. The lawsuit states that O'Leary and Brady, quote, promoted, assisted in, and actively participated in FTX offer and sale of unregistered securities. The lawsuit charges that Liverostos lost his $30,000 investment, quote, literally overnight when FTX imploded, filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy. The suit alleges that Brady and O'Leary perpetrated, quote, misrepresentations and omissions while aggressively marketing the deceptive FTX practices. Boy, that's, that's, really, that's really a damning quote right there misrepresentations, that's a colorful way of saying Brady lied, O'Leary lied, and, potenti- and, and, and intentionally omitted important facts about the situation that people were getting themselves into. That's a bad look. Bankman Freed has also been hit with charges by the U.S. Department of Justice, including wire fraud, securities fraud, and conspiracy to commit wire fraud and securities fraud. If given the full penalty upon conviction, he could face 115 years in prison. Oh, wow. This is absolutely a terrible look for Tom Brady. And uh, there's going to be a lot more fallout behind this. I heard the other day that there was potential that this situation, okay, involving FTX and Brady could actually be what retires Brady. Okay, that this may actually end up having to having to be forcing it to be his focus after his playing career or for him to walk away because he's staring at what truly could be some bad, bad repercussions 
in the short or long term involving this FTX situation and the fact that it seems this NFL legend, the GOAT himself, somebody that you know both myself and Matrix are big fans of, that he got himself involved with and sold to potential customers that bought into this nightmare. And that's just what it is. A nightmare. And, uh, man, I've seen some interviews lately involving people that were directly around him on a day-to-day basis. And this Bankman Freed was a true space cadet. He was all over the place. He lacked total focus while just playing with billions of dollars in people's money. Okay? I mean, it's frightening. And some of the testimony I've heard back and forth with people asking him questions is it is unbelievably cringy considering the amount of responsibility and money that people allowed this guy to play with. It's baffling. And I'm sure this guy being a Patriots fan... Tom Brady uh, conduct, seems to conduct his business very thoroughly, we thought. M- almost militaristically, we thought. You would think that he would have every base covered because that's how he lives his professional life that we see. And it looks to us like a lot of people didn't was not paying attention, didn't do their due diligence here. Or a lot of people just got lied to. Brady included. We don't know. We don't know. We'll have to reserve judgment. Tell me what you think, black and white sports fans. Peace them out. Make sure you subscribe. Till next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.